The eruption of Mount Vesuvius in 79 AD was both horrific and historic. It froze the city of Pompeii in time until excavations began in the 1700s. Since then, many of the ruins and colourful frescoes have crumbled thanks to careless excavations, rainfall, clumsy tourists and even Second World War bombings. Putting them back together is hugely time-consuming. It also doesn't increase the knowledge or the understanding or the expertise of the archaeologists of the conservators. It's just putting the pieces together. The real work for the archaeologists comes after that. So researchers in Italy are planning to 3D scan every single piece of some frescoes and use artificial intelligence and robots to put them back together. We have also to take into consideration there could be parts of the drawing that is over the fresco that are not visible easily. So we will use um, this type of technology to investigate what could, be, could have been there. In 2010, the gladiators' barracks collapsed. Photos can be used, like the cover of a jigsaw puzzle box, to help with reconstruction. But with the so-called House of the Lovers hit by Allied bombs in 1943, AI will have to work harder. Because we do not have the, the box and we don't know how it looked like in the past. The project aims to help everyone in archaeology focus on research instead of puzzle solving. But if our system uh, works, then we can export that technology and we will be able to uh, reconstruct uh, frescoes that nowadays are just stored into storerooms. The project is expected to take four years, but that's only the blink of an eye for patient historians. Redmond Shannon, Global News, London.